McCain, are you anywhere near downtown? Uh, sure, Chief. Why? We got reports that a gang is trying to abduct Forrest Blackwell. They've got him on top of a building near the downtown science museum. I'm on my way, Chief. Has backup been dispatched? Yes, but by the time they get there, it'll be too late. So hurry up! I really don't want to get on the wrong side of Forrest Blackwell. Gonna leave a dead. I need to find a blue color swapper.
You see how cool that was? Dave! Dave! Whoa! Look! An awning! If this was an action movie, someone would fall onto that. Whoa! <laughs> Ow! That really smarts. Could my day get any worse? <clears throat> Merciful heavens above! Help at last! Arrest these men! Get him! That's right. You show him what for. Dust yourself off and get back in there, young man. That was a good bunch of twos. Ha! He won't soon forget that hiding. Uh, 
Excellent. Queensbury rules. That'll serve the ruffian right. Go on, knock him for six. That's right. Give him the business. That's right. You yeah. Thank you, young man. I thought my fate was sealed. Now while I'm on duty, sir. They may have reinforcements, so we ought to leave here at once. My car should still be nearby. Sorry we're late, Chase. Not that it looks like you needed our help. Young man, I should feel a lot safer at the police station. Would you mind driving me? I'm still rather shaken. Go on. I'll call the chief and tell him you got Mr. Blackwell down safely. We'll stay here and round up the gang members. Thank you. I'm dreadfully sorry. I haven't even asked your name. I'm Chase. Chase McCain. Uh, we've never met before. Chase McCain. Well, what a tiny world we live in. You know, I was only recently talking to an acquaintance of mine about you. About all the effort you went to in arresting Rex Fury. He doesn't think Chief Dunby did that? Oh, no. Some of us have a far clearer view of those events. Unmuddied by spin. Such a pity Rex got out again. Who knows what fiendish things he's up to. Yeah. So, who were those men back there? Environmental activists, no doubt. They don't care for me at all. Why don't they like you? You don't know. I thought everyone did. Simply an unfortunate misunderstanding that I have put completely behind me now. The main thing is, you're safe now. Yes. I must have a word with my security people. Well, this is nice. Lovely day for a drive. You're just taking the scenic route. Terrible traffic today. Ooh, lovely architecture. We're here. Mr. Blackwell, I, I am so relieved you're safe. I can barely sleep. Thank you again, Chase. You sleep during work hours. Well, uh, uh, let me take you inside. Thank you. Farewell, Chase McCain. I'm sure we will meet again. <laughs> oh, that rhyme. Natalia. I... I might, I repeat might, need your help. I couldn't find my dad in any of Chan's other offices. So... I decided to try a salvage yard and now I'm stuck in here. What? I was desperate. It is my dad, Chase. What if Chan catches you? That won't happen. I'm completely hidden. Oh! <gasps> hey, whose feet are sticking out from behind my curtains? Help! Natalia? 
Natalia! Ellie, I need a favor and the Chief cannot know about it. Name it. Natalia's in trouble at Chan's junkyard and I'm gonna need backup to get her out. Natalia Kowalski? What are you up to? It's a long story. Can you help? Sure. I know a couple of officers who don't mind going behind the Chief's back. I'll tell them to meet you outside the salvage yard, and I'll get them to bring a disguise. We don't want Chan recognizing you. Thanks, Ellie. You don't know how much this means to me. Where's my backup? You meant to be here by now. <laughs> hey, Chase. Okay, Studsky and Clutch are here. Where's the lady in distress? Clutch, Studsky, thanks for this. Natalia's in Chan's salvage yard. The Chief arrested some of his gang earlier, but he's still got a lot of heavies in there. Do you have a disguise for me? Do we ever! <laughs> that is perfect, Studsky. Really? They belong to our friend Huggy. He has no sense of personal space. Let's go rescue this girl. Come on! I'm gonna have to take these things off. Those two, they're cops. You, go and warn the bus. I guess the softly, softly approach is out of the question. You ready, Studsky? I was born ready. Ready for what? We've got to get to Natalia as fast as possible. Chan could be doing anything to get information out of her. Like giving her ice cream? What? He's not going to try to bribe her, Studsky. No, I mean I get really bad headaches from ice cream. I'd tell you anything if you threaten me with it. Especially mint chocolate. Ugh. Right. Or they could make her drink loads of soda pop and she'd get trapped wind because ladies can't burp in public. My mom does that all the time. Your mom ain't no lady. Yeah. Oh, I thought of another one. They could... All right. That really isn't helping. Ooh. Ooh. I need to get that gate open.
A couple more cans of fuel and I can start that generator. It's a fuel can and a washing machine. No wonder it's in a scrapyard. Look at me, I'm on a roll. I'm not sure he's the kind of dog that likes being petted. Sheesh! Oh. How much fridge space do you need?
here, doggy doggy. That model was a classic. Now that is what I call a compact car. Ooh, I can use it to get up onto that pile of junk.
Remember, scrapyards are dangerous places which shouldn't be played in. You hear me? Good luck getting over the grinder! <laughs> That's a subtle arrow. So, is Natalia ticklish? What? Is she ticklish? Once I got tickled so badly by a mugger that I told him the security code for my bank card. You told me he threatened you. Yeah, with more tickling. So you're really ticklish, are you? Don't even think about it, Clutch. You already know my security code anyway. You still haven't changed it from your birthday? <laughs> Duh, yeah, to my twin sisters. Maybe I can use those cars as platforms? Not bad. I'm normally afraid of changing my car's oil. Ugh. <laughs> 
teleporter built out of scrap? <sighs> if I come out the other end as a fly, I will not be happy. <sighs> oh, good. More bad guys. Well, at least my head isn't on backwards or anything. Hang on. Oh, sorry. Poor choice of words. Are you gonna get me down anytime soon? I'll have you down in a minute. About time? Oh, sorry. I mean, thanks. I just need to find the button to lower you gently. Ah! Yeah, that wasn't it. Oh. Oh. He made me eat ice cream. Hold it! Oh. Studsky, let's make ourselves scarce before the chief shows up. See ya, Chase! Thanks, guys. And you've got to keep out of this, Natalia. I'll find your dad. I promise. I don't want to see you get hurt. Okay. Okay. Stay out of trouble. I will. Hey! Starting from now? Because of your blundering around in Chan's salvage yard, he's disappeared, which is gonna make it somewhat tricky to arrest him. But I had to rescue- I don't wanna hear it! I'm transferring you to Sheriff Huckleberry's department in the forest until we've cleared up this mess. Does he need our help with solving a case? Ha! Doubtful. His district has the lowest amount of crime in all of Lego City, which is why I want you there, so you can't cause trouble. What about the Fury investigation? I put my most highly decorated officer on the case, my protege. I like to think of him as the son I never had and who looks nothing like me. <laughs> if anyone could get results, it's him!
Hi, Frank. What did you do to get sent out here, then? Are you sure you're a qualified plumber, honey? Of course! Ah! Honey! Nothing? That's right, deputy. Huh? I got you cornered. Huckleberry's in It's just you and me. Frank, Because I sent your boss on a wild you goose chase. Side. After a wild oh. goose! Say. Prayers? Oh, sorry. <laughs> hey there, Chase. We're just finishing rehearsing our play. <laughs> okay. You gotta do something to fill your days around here. Nothing exciting ever happens. I, uh, the front door was locked? Calm down, Derek. Don't worry, you two. Your chief warned me you're coming, and I've drawn up a work roster. Frank, you'll be in charge of making sure we do not run out of coffee. You can trust me, Sheriff Huckleberry. And Chase. I broke the coffee machine. <laughs> Derek! Language! Well, then. Both of you be rounding up Farmer Hayes' escaped pigs. His farm's to the south of here. I'd go myself, but it's curtains up tonight, and I still don't know all my lines. We're on it. Come on, Chase! Let's go see the nanimals! It's not a petting zoo, Frank. Right. The sooner we find those animals, the sooner I can get back to finding Rex. Hey! Look! Horses! Do we get to use them? I guess. Can you ride a horse? It depends. Are these ones stick shift or automatic? Maybe you should just walk. See you later! Chase! My horse is stuck in reverse! And it doesn't have 